let's make our first project. In Eclipse, when you want to start doing something new, you always start out by making a project. And in our case, what we're going to do is we're going to make a new Java project. So under File menu, there's File, New, Java Project. We have to give the Java project a name. Practically any name will work here. And this is just the high-level folder name. In general, we're going to find that as we start using Eclipse, there are lots and lots of screens that ask for lots and lots of information. But in general, all that you have to do is take the default. So in this case, rather than uh, pressing the next key, we're just going to put the minimum amount of information in, the folder name, and hit Finish. And if you look in the Project Explorer, it's now created a folder called Stuff. The icon marks it as a Java project. If you open that up, you are going to find that it's included some goodies for you. The JRE system libraries are stuff that Java needs to run, and that's always going to be included in any Java project that you do. Right now, we don't actually have any files in this project that are of use to us, and in particular, we don't have any source files. Essentially, this is just an empty folder. So, to make an actual piece of Java code, you can go and you can select New Java Class from there. And again, now we have to give the file within the folder a name. So in this case, let's do something like first project as a name. And in order to run this thing and make it useful to us, we're going to click on the box that says public, static, void, main, and all of that goodies. That's just the place where the program starts. Now we're going to click Finish. And now we have a file that's been created called firstproject.java, and some code has been generated for us in the editing window. And notice that the name here is the same name as, uh, as what we called our .java file. One of the keys in Java is that all classes should begin with a capital letter to start with, and every word after that should, be, should also be a capital letter. And if you make a class called first project, then the file name has to be firstproject.java. This is actually a code template. In our case, uh, we're not going to worry about comments at this point, so we're just going to get rid of that. And we're also not going to worry about this other special kind of comment. We're going to get rid of that. And there's your basic Java project. So it consists of an outer class and followed by a function called main, which is where all of your, your program is going to start. So here we go. We can do a traditional program that prints out some information. And we'll just type something like hello there. And we'll make sure we add a semicolon onto the end of the line. And there's our Java program, which consists of nothing but one print statement. Now, admittedly, people have complained that the print statement has a, a little bit funny syntax and isn't as simple as we'd like. Uh, but in essence, we're not going to do very many print statements. So at this point, we're not going to worry about it. You can save the project if you want. Now to run it, you hit the green Run button. And the output from your program appears down below.